Mark Douglas was a very successful trader. He is famous for his work on trading psychology. He wrote several books on trading psychology focusing on the concept of investing and a trader's mindset. Mark Douglas' book, Trading in the Zone, is considered the most vital guiding book in the world of trading. This book is also known as The Bible of Trading. In this book, Mark Douglas, from a psychological perspective, presented the most common issues related to trading and offered great strategies to face them in the best way possible. In this video, we are going to present you with five Mark Douglas trading psychology lessons from his famous book, Trading in the Zone. Number one, market analysis is not the path to consistent results and it will not solve the trading problems created by lack of confidence, lack of discipline, or improper focus. If you rely on other people's market analysis to enter or hold a position, you will almost certainly lose a lot of money. Most market analyses will tell you where the market might go. However, it will almost never teach you or provide you with options for managing and exiting the trade. Don't enter or exit a trade based solely on someone else's analysis. Know your trading method first and put the trading analysis in front of your trading strategies. Having a trading plan and strategy will give confidence and a way to stay focused and disciplined. Number 2. Successful traders virtually eliminated the effects of fear and recklessness from their trading. Fear and greed are two essential emotions that everyone experiences during their trading journey. Fear can hold you back from cashing the successful trading opportunities while greed can put you in a situation resulting in your loss of money. You may fall prey to these emotions if you don't have a trading plan and strategy. When you have a proper trading plan and trading strategy, you won't let certain market situations induce fear and greed in you and make impulsive decision making. You can only be a successful trader when you won't let your emotions come in your way. Number 3. Learning more and more about the markets only to avoid pain will compound his problems because the more he learns, the more he will naturally expect from the markets, making it all the more painful when the markets don't do their part. Trading is contentious with traps and pitfalls. One of them is influencing your market expectations. Your outcomes are an unintended consequence of your process. That is why you must detach yourself from the results and attach yourself to the process, which will consistently push you to go beyond your expectations. When the trade is running, you must let your rules speak for themselves and disregard other people's opinions. Number 4. Fear makes it very difficult, if not impossible, to open ourselves in a way that allows us to learn something new. Professional and successful, they are constantly learning new things. They are not afraid to try new things. They are more concerned with their growth than with their profits. However, arrogant traders are overly concerned with the rewards. They believe their strategy is the holy grail and that all others are nonsense. They are overly focused on their trade and use it to justify losses. Eliminate your fears in trading. Start small and increase your trading capital gradually. Look forward to building your trading business instead of finding the right time to withdraw money from it. Open yourself to possibilities instead of being too enclosed in what you have. The trading world will be your oyster. Number 5. Only the best traders cut their losses without reservation or hesitation when the market tells them the trade isn't working. There will always be the agony of cutting losses, no matter how long you trade. However, it is best to never forget why you placed it in the first place. Limiting losses and knowing exactly when you are wrong. Use automatic stop-loss orders to your advantage. Having an automatic stop-loss order allows you to make objective decisions without physically being present. That's correct. You are the master of your trading portfolio, and your trading platform is your employee who makes decisions for you ahead of time. Trading in the Zone by Mark Douglas is undoubtedly one of the best books for traders to spend their time and money. Despite what we've taught you today, the book has far more to teach you than what we've covered today. Hope you enjoyed the video. 
Leave a comment to tell us how these lessons did impact you. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to stay tuned to such helpful content. Thanks for watching.